Welcome everyone to this tutorial video on how to register on rcmoves.in. So to register on rcmoves.in, first go to the browser and type rcmoves.in and press enter. So it will take you to this home page of rcmoves.in. And if you can see on this page, so there is uh, various tabs. So this is the home home tab, then new registration tab, then this is a tab for various programs and if anyone wants to become resource person for our programs then they can fill this form then there is collaboration form also so if any university or college is willing to uh, collaborate with us in uh, conducting some uh, refresher course or some faculty development program then they can fill this form and this is the certificate tab so from if you click on here you can find all the certificates of all the programs conducted uh, in this program so you <coughs> then this is help section so if you need any further help then you can always so this is a uh, rc MOOC guide so if you will click on this then it will download a file for you where you can see step by step process to register on rcmoves.in and this is about payment status so if you will click on this then you can enter if you have made some payment and it is the, the very payment status is showing pending or uh, it is showing filled then you can always check from here also so let us go back so then if you see on the right of this so there are various programs which are currently undergoing the last date for this program is 23rd november so the so these are all programs which are still open so if you click on any of these programs then it will download the brochure of that program for you and you can see you can check the details of the, that program and if you find that program interesting enough then you can always register for that program so since we so this is our this is the brochure for our program which is a refresher course in math, applicable mathematics which is in collaboration with Deshbandhu Col College now for to register for this program you need to first uh, click on new registration if you have already registered in some other program then you just need to enter your email id and password and you can proceed so for an, anyone who is visiting this website for the first time and who has not yet registered on this uh, website then they need to first uh, they need to make the registration this is the one time registration and can be used to attend any pro any program so you need to enter your name then your email id then your mobile number and then your password so let us just let me just give you a demo of this so my name then it will ask me the email id so let me just enter this math refresher at ramanujan.du.ac.in and let me just so it needs mobile number so so i am just taking the reverse order 9876543213 okay then you just enter the password so any password you like and click on submit so once you will submit it will send a uh, verification mail to your website or to your email address so you need to first verify your account so just go to this so you can see as soon as I, I, I and click the submit button I have received a mail from uh, TLC Ramanujan College so I need to click on this verify button to verify myself. So it is showing the message account verified successfully. So now you can, so we are already signed in for because if you are not logged out then we are already signed in. So now if you can see there are so many programs which are already undergoing. So now because we want to register for refresher course in mathematics which is a two week uh, refresher course so we need to click on this two week faculty development program and it, it is now showing two types of uh, programs interdisciplinary refresher course and disciplinary refresher course because our is mathematics refresher course so it is disciplinary so we will click on this and then under this click on applicable mathematics 
so once you will click on applicable mathematics it will take you to this page which will take all your data for this program so it will ask you to enter all your data so your full name then email id then your mobile number then date of birth educational qualification designation department then university and all those things so let me just fill the details for you so so select the year then month and then your date so then your educational qualification so this then your designation so there are so many options professor associate professor assistant professor and if you have any other uh, uh, designation then you can click on other and then you can write your designation here then department so again you uh, so ours is mathematics department so let us see if there is one department with name mathematics so as you can see you we are not getting mathematics so what we will do we will just write department of mathematics and it will or you need to write other here so once you will click other so it will give you the and option to write your department so if your department is not there in the drop down list write you can choose the option of other and then you can put uh, so department of mathematical sciences is there but if you want to write department of mathematics or any other department then you can choose the option of other here so just write other it will give you the option to choose other click here then enter your department name so department of mathematics then you can write your name of your university so university university of delhi so if you are you if you have only college name then you can put the same in the university name of university also so then nature of employment so you can put any of these choice and if you have any other nature of employment then you can click on other and then you can put here like guest lecture or any other type of lecture adjunct professor or any any type of uh, uh, type of employment is there so you can put here so you can choose the type of uh, employment you have then you can put uh, the name of the college so name of the college again if it is same as the university you can click here so it will fill the university if you want it different then you can simply write your name of the college so as you can see we so ramanujan college then your gender and then you can choose your state so it is then you can put your address and then your city name so again city name and then pin code so we put pin code here and then save next and continue so after filling all the details you will get this so now you can see you, you have selected one course and this is the name of the course two week faculty development of, uh, disciplinary refresher course and the name of the course is applicable mathematics and it is starting on 15th of december and ending on 29th december so now after checking all the details you can click on apply here and once you click on apply it will take you to the payment gateway so so now it is it has taken us to payment gateway and this is the so to pay the registration fee you need to click on pay now and once you click on pay now it will take you to this payment page and you can see that it is asking for so you can make the payment through paytm or any other upi app so either you can directly scan this or you can pay through any debit card if you have credit card upie or even net banking you can use to make the payment and this is your transaction id which you can keep note of and so because i am not going to make payment so now i am going back so after completing the payment you can uh, it will take you to this page so i am canceling this payment so as you can see my order status is transaction failed order id was this and it is showing transaction failed so on successful completion of the payment an email will be sent to 
the registered email id having the order id and confirmation for the program applied for also you should note if your bank account is debited so main suppose uh, if you if you are making the payment and you here you are seeing the transaction failed but uh, your amount is debited from your account then it will come back to your account in two to three working days so you if if the status here is transaction failed then you must contact uh, your bank for the payment because uh, we have not received your payment so we can't we cannot refund it it is your bank which will refund it and generally it takes it comes back it it is refunded automatically in two to three working days like it happens in all other uh, e-commerce platforms so uh, or for any further queries or issues you can always write at rc mooks rc mooks m o c s at ramanujan.du.ac.in so thank you hope you now you will be you will easily register for this program